How would you feel if I tell you that I don't ever want to get married? Getting married is for you and not for me. You getting married is becoming a long walk to freedom. And I don't like it. You have a comfortable job. You're tall, you're handsome. You have everything going on well for you. So tell me, what are you still waiting for? Uh, you're all the same. Not to be trusted. You just need to understand that we're up against a man who visibly lives above the emotion women invoke. It's either his manhood is not functioning or he's a homosexual. No, you won't say that about my son. But you said you don't want to keep any woman as a wife. Yes, a decision that I feel that people around me must respect. I brought classy ladies for him. He turned them down, he rejected them all. She violated everything and killed me from the soul. Some battles are not necessary. Especially when you're fighting for what you have already. I think you need to travel to the village and trace the root of your problem. Marriage is not by force. It's a necessity, but not by force. I am trying so hard to understand what you're saying. What I am saying, mother, is that I've had enough. Mother, I have tolerated enough. I've had it up to here, beyond my limits. You see that your candidate that you smuggled here as a cook, oh, she's been fired. Do you know who Ijoma is? Oh, who is she? I see a woman who's nothing but a loose, desperate woman. That's what I see. And I have no business with a character like that. But you need to know that your son is a very difficult person. So difficult. 